This simple set of exercises is a short and sweet Kriya to get your energy moving. So please bring your hands together, rubbing them together. And take your palms to prayer pose, thumbs at your heart center. Long, slow breath in, long breath out. Roll your eyes up to your third eye and we chant to tune in. Inhale to begin. Om Namo Gurudev Namo Om Namo Gurudev Namo Om And then please inhale, just feel the vibration, exhale, relaxing your arms. Give yourself a moment just to feel. And now the first exercise. Sitting tall through the spine, extend your left leg out, toes pointed straight up. Sole of the right foot is on the inside of the left thigh. Then bending from your hips, extending over that straight leg, elongate your spine and let your hands rest wherever they rest. So that might be the foot, it may be the shin. Make sure that the spine is long and open and let the chin be at a 90 degree angle to the spine. Hold on to your foot if you can, squeezing the big toe. Otherwise, just let your hands rest where they can. The breath is long, slow, and deep. Hold steady, stretching until you feel a gentle challenge, just a bit of resistance. In this pose, bring your awareness to the inhale and the exhale, noticing what each part of the breath brings to you in your physical body. Inhale to rise up and exhale as you come back to neutral. Now we switch legs, same thing on the other side. Flexing the right foot, extending the right leg. Put the sole of the left foot on the inside of the right thigh. And then exhale over the right leg, holding where you can. The idea is not necessarily to get the heart or the face as close to the leg as possible. The idea is to get your navel point down onto the thigh and then lay the body down from there. Again, keep the chin at a 90 degree angle to the spine and breathe long and slow. Letting the sensations arise, noticing how the inhalation and the exhalation affect the sensations in the body. Let your arms be relaxed. And again, you're moving into this to where you feel a gentle challenge, an acceptable edge. Don't push yourself beyond that. And now please inhale up and exhale, relax the hands. Now once again, stretch your left leg out, placing the right foot against the inner thigh. Now you're going to take the right hand, the back of the right hand is going to be placed against your back body, and tilting your pelvis forward, looking over the right shoulder, keeping the chin toward the right shoulder, lift your chest up high, Being careful to keep the chin turned toward the right shoulder, keeping the left ear away from the left shoulder. Feeling a gentle sideways stretch over your left leg. Feel the sensation in your hamstring. 
in your right hip. Rotating that right shoulder up and open so that you feel the chest lifting to the sky. Gently stretching sideways over your left leg. Noticing the inhalation and the exhalation of this long, deep breath. Feeling expansive as you inhale and feel that gentle relaxation that comes with the exhalation. Just be alive to the sensations as they arise within you. Finding relaxation where you can in your body. And then we inhale up and exhale back to neutral. And now we do the right side. Let's extend the right leg, sole of the left foot on the inside of the right thigh, reaching your hand out against the shin or the foot, whatever feels right. Take the back of the left hand to the lower back, open the left shoulder to the sky, tilting the pelvis so that the heart center rises up. Keep your chin turned toward the left shoulder. Take care to keep the right ear away from the right shoulder. And let the breath be long and deep, experiencing the sensation in the back of your leg, in the hamstring. Feel what you feel in the back body. Feel the long line of your side body down into your hip. Finding relaxation with every exhalation. Feel gravity doing the work here. And then inhaling up to the center, exhaling. Just feel for a moment. Now moving back into easy pose, take your hands onto your shins and we're going to do a basic spinal flex. That means that as you inhale, you lift your heart up and open. As you exhale, you open up the back of the heart so you spread the shoulder blades open, but keep the shoulders neutral, keep the chin parallel to the floor and let the movement be in the spine. We're moving the bones of the back. You'll feel as you inhale forward that you're rocking in front of your sitting bones. And as you flow back on the exhale, you're behind your sitting bones. Start to feel the movement in your back body. Bringing circulation into the back. Find some smoothness to this motion. Allow it to be fluid and without break. Let the eyes focus at the third eye and start to introduce the mantra Sat Nam. It means truth is my identity. So as you inhale forward, mentally vibrate the word Sat. And as you exhale, mentally vibrate the word Nam. Inhale Sat, exhale Nam. As you flow, just moving the bones of the back, keeping the shoulders relaxed, eyes at the third eye. This very simple exercise is wonderful for increasing circulation to the back, to the spinal cord, the spinal column. Working through the sacrum, the part of the spine attached to the pelvis. Get your energy moving. That's what this Kriya is doing, moving the energy. Inhaling to the center and exhaling, relax.
Now for the next exercise, please lay down on your back with your arms by your sides, your palms flat against your mat. As you inhale, bring your left knee up to your chest and at the same time, bring your right arm up. Exhale back to the starting position and repeat with the opposite arm and leg. Concentrating at your navel center, inhaling, bringing the arm up overhead all the way to the floor behind you. Exhaling, taking it all the way down. As your arm rises up, the knee comes up against the chest. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Find a flow here. We call this the cross crawl. Breathe from the navel center. The navel center is three finger widths below your belly button. Find a rhythm with the breath. Just stay in your own flow, going at your own pace. Knee rising into the chest, arm overhead, and then returning back to the original position. Keep the pace going just a little longer. Inhaling that knee into the chest, arm overhead, exhaling everything back down to the floor. And now we relax, inhale and exhale. And now we move into cat cow, placing the hands under the shoulders, knees under the hips. Spread your fingers wide. As you inhale, melt your heart to the floor. Exhale, take your chin to your chest. Open up the spine. Inhale into cow, exhale into cat. The cow position is melting the heart to the floor, opening through the throat. The cat position is opening the spine to the sky, tilting the tailbone under. Inhale as the face rises up, exhale as the chin moves to the chest. Staying smooth as you move, feel your spine. Find your rhythm, nice smooth motion. No stopping, no starting. One continuous flow. Feel the flexibility in your spine as you flow continuously through this movement. You can add the mantra Sat Nam. Inhaling Sat as the face rises up, exhaling Nam as the chin moves to the chest. Feel the pelvis tilting. In the cat cow, much like a table has four legs, you're going to use your arms and your legs to hold your body in even balance. Find the balance across the shoulders and across the pelvis as well. Feel your hands, your knees, and the tops of the feet all connected to the earth. You can increase the pace if that feels right to you. This is an excellent exercise for the back. You're really working on your entire spine here. Then please inhale to the center with your back flat like a tabletop, and then exhale, relax. Now for the next exercise, sit back on your heels, Make sure that your buttocks are still in contact with the heels. If the buttocks rise up off the heels in this position, you're going to want to add a blanket or a cushion in between so that you're actually sitting on something. Resting our forehead on the floor, arms are down by the sides, 
So your hands are near your ankles and your palms are facing open. The baby pose is a very restorative, introverted posture. So just listen to the sound of your own breath as you begin to let go of the muscles in the back. In the same way that ice cream melts in the sun, melt the back body. Relax your shoulders. Just listen to and feel the flow of your own breath. Now please bring your hands under your shoulders and unfold your vertebrae one at a time, head coming up last. Pause here for a moment just to feel. Come into easy pose, use some support if you need. Take the arms open, palms facing up, then bend at the elbows, let your fingers come to the front, thumbs in the back. We begin the spinal twist. So your spine is long, the top of the head is moving toward the sky, and we inhale as we twist to the left, exhale to the right. In this position, we're twisting around a central axis, and that axis is the spine. Let every inhale be on the left side. Every exhale is when you're looking to the right. Keep the heart open, so that means that your shoulders stay active. Though we're working in the spine, we are also working in the heart center. So feel expansive and open through your heart center. Let your head follow along with your shoulders, keeping the shoulders relaxed away from your ears. Let your elbows stay parallel to the floor. This movement can be felt in the spine from the base of the spine all the way up. This movement brings energy by bringing circulation into the back body. Please come to the center, inhale to finish, and exhale, relaxing the hands down. Place your hands right onto your knees as we move into the next exercise, shoulder rolls. Rolling your shoulders in a big, slow circle, inhaling as they rise up by your ears, exhale, squeezing the shoulder blades together. Roll through any tension, any stiffness, any places where you're really gripping on. Breathing normally as we circle the shoulders, just roll through the shoulders, bringing them up by the ears and then squeezing the shoulder blades together. Big, slow circles. And then we pause to stop, inhale, and exhale. Just relax here for a moment. And now please lay down on your back. We're going to do a deep relaxation. Your arms are by your sides, so the palms facing open. Gently close your eyes. Let your breath become soft. Let go of trying to change the breath and just let it flow. If you need to put something under your knees for comfort for your lower back, then take a bolster or a cushion. Just let go and relax. Every time you exhale, letting go of a bit more tension with every inhalation, relaxing your forehead. We do a deep relaxation to allow the effects of all of the exercises to fully integrate in our body. Just feel the rise and the fall of your chest, the flow of your breath, letting your lungs spontaneously inflate and deflate.
and then please inhale. Exhale, stretch the arms overhead, bring the knees into the chest, rub the soles of the feet together, rub your hands together, and then rock to bring yourself up to sitting. Take a moment and just feel. Bring your hands together. Satnam.